Uh, welcome to this channel. Today I'll be bringing to you how we teach you how to uh, remove the shortcut virus on your flash drive. Okay. Now, what is a shortcut virus? A shortcut virus is a virus that affects your your USB devices, your hard disk, your PC entirely. Okay. And what it does basically is to uh, create shortcut each time you insert your USB, each time you plug in your USB into your system. It automatically hides all your files and creates a shortcut with the original name of the device. Okay, so um, let's get a point out. My flash disk now is actually infected, so yeah, I'm going to teach you how to manually remove and recover your files. Okay, how to remove the virus and recover your files. So um, look at this is my computer. I just inserted my flash drive. This is my flash. You can see the name was alive. When I open it, this is a shortcut. Nothing is happening inside. Though on my PC, if I click on this, uh, if I click on this shortcut here, it will automatically open and I can view my files, right? But on any other system, I can't. This shortcut cannot be executed. It only runs on my own system because the virus is actually in my PC right now. So um, for us to actually recover all these our files, what we need to do is very simple. First of all, just click on View here. Make sure that this hidden item there uh, is checked. Make sure it is checked. Then um, another thing you do is click on the option. Okay. So when you click on option, go to the view tab. Then scroll down to where they said hide protected uh, operating system. Hide protected operating system files. It's already checked. Just uncheck it. I ask you this question. You have, have you, you have chosen to display protected operating system files. Blah, blah, blah. Just click yes and click OK. All right. Now, once done, you're going to see all these things here. You have seen all these things here are form of uh, system files which the virus has converted your system into. So here is actually the main device. So when I open it, you will see all my content right inside okay all right so um what i'm going to do right now is just simple first of all just press on ctrl a use ctrl a to highlight everything then ctrl x to cut all the files okay now i'm coming back again to this device here and i can simply create a new folder here Control shift n to create a new folder so I can just call it anything okay can just call it my my disk or my device just play my device and press the whole thing inside so we wait for it to to paste all right yeah, yes. Keep. Alright, so I have succeeded in uh, copying everything into this my device. This, that's the new folder I created. Now I can quickly delete every of these things here. Alright, just uh, mark and use delete delete everything. I actually want to to delete yes. The file system is this is that yes. Just click this and yes. Alright now my flash is cleaned now nothing is inside apart from this folder that I created inside. Now like this I have finally recovered uh, my all my files within my my disk okay you can see that now I've recovered all my files right I can actually decide to copy all these things and move them back into the root uh, folder of the device all right okay now if I insert my flash line or any other system it is going to work perfectly I will see all my files I've recovered everything okay so for your own uh, security purpose, there is need for you to still go back to this option here and go back to view. Go back and 
on the high protected operating system, shake it back again and come back. That helps you to make sure that you don't mistakenly delete any of your system files that could lead to system malfunction. Alright? So now we're going to look at how we can because if you have actually clicked on that shortcut initially, automatically your your system or your PC is likely to be infected. So anytime you put this flash back into your own PC that is infected with this virus, it will, the, the virus will still do its job again, which is reconverting all your files into shortcuts and hiding the main file. Okay? So there is need for us to get rid of all the viruses in our PC and make sure that our PC is clean. So this time around, we are going to head over to. We are going to head. Let me close this. We are going to head over to our browser, and on the browser, we are going to visit uh, Dr. Web website. So you can see the link on the at the top here. Okay. So this is the link. You can also get the link in the description uh, below. Okay. You can get the link in the description below. So uh, all you need to do is click on download Dr. Web Theory. Okay. Once you click on that to get started with downloading of this file. Then here, make sure you all these boxes here are checked and download Dr. Web Theory. All right. So in my own case, I've already downloaded it. So once it is downloaded, once it is downloaded, you will see uh, you will see the the file here. So let me click and open the folder. All right. So this is it. I need to do just to install it. Now make sure you accept uh, the administrator's privileges once you open it. If they ask you if you want it to run as administrator, just click it and then wait. Alright, so this is it. All you need to do right here is click on this, I agree, and then continue. Start scanning. It is scanning everything in your system. So we are going to wait for it to finish scanning, okay? Okay, I area post this video because uh, this is going to really take a whole lot of time. So I wouldn't want the video to be too long, so I have to pause it. And as you can see, uh, a lot of files have been scanned already, yet no virus has been detected. That's because I've already scanned my system. Like my system was earlier scanned before putting up this uh, video tutorial. So, uh, if you're scanning your own system and for the first time, you're likely to detect a lot of uh, viruses in your own system, as if it is infected actually. So currently now I can see one threat has been detected already, even after I have scanned my system earlier, before now. So we are going to still keep waiting for the scanning to be completed. So once the scanning is fully completed, you will see the list of all the virus that is in your system listed below. Alright, so I will pause this video again and wait until the scan is completed 100% alright now uh, the scanning is completed so all we need to do is just to click on the neutralize button okay so once you click on the neutralize button it is going to neutralize all the viruses that is uh, detected already so far so we are neutralizing it now we are going to wait for it to finish Okay, now the neutralization is completed. So now that it is complete, there is nothing left again to be done, but just to uh, close the window. All right, just close the window, and it will ask you to restart your system. So I'm going to reboot the system, but let me save this video first. Then after that, I'm rebooting the system. 
okay so i'll see you people after the reboot all right guys i just finished restarting my system right now so i'm i've inserted my uh inserting my usb device now okay so as i've inserted it yeah i can see it's out now okay and it will never create that uh shortcut again because i've removed the virus that is uh doing all those this is the flash okay i see that now so that's how you can uh recover your files from your that are, that are hidden in your usb device and as well as remove the shortcut virus that is responsible for creating those shortcuts thank you and don't forget to subscribe like and share this video thank you